Want an e-bike? What if you could turn the bike you already have into an e-bike? And what if it costs less than an e-bike and didn't require you to attend a weekend workshop in order to learn how? That, friends, is the Switch Kit which allows you to turn practically any bicycle into an e-bike over the course of one lazy Saturday morning. And we recently got our hands on one to try out for ourselves to see if it was all it was cracked up to be. And well, we had mixed feelings and came to one main conclusion. Spoiler alert, we don't think you should buy this kit. But let's start with the pros because there are a fair amount. For starters, the Switch Kit is brilliant. It's sleek, functional, and works well. The pickup is smooth, it's powerful, I mean, it can move, and it's way more affordable than purchasing a good quality e-bike. Plus, it lets you continue to use the bike you already have, which is great. I also love how compact the battery is. Just unclip it, toss it in your bag, and away you go. It does require minimal knowledge to actually put together as it comes in a kit you have to install yourself, but the Switch team says they will hop on a video chat with you to ensure it's installed correctly for, you know, safe use. Which they did do for me. They said my installation was textbook BT dubs. But is an affordable, tolerably easy to install e-bike conversion kit that performs this well too good to be true? It might be. But let's back up to the beginning, to when we received the first pieces of our kit, six months before we were finally able to take it out for a spin. Yup, you heard me, six months. It began when Switch reached out to us to ask if we wanted to test their new e-bike conversion kit. We scanned the website, did some research, and said, heck yeah. They proceeded to send us a contract to sign that said we'd need to send the kit back in two weeks. Now, we've been doing gear reviews for years now, and while brands will occasionally request gear be sent back after testing, maybe even propose a reasonable timeline, we've never been given a contract with such a short turnaround. One that will seem very comical in just a few short moments. Essentially, it just came across like they weren't sure what they were doing yet. Naturally, we said there's no way we can assemble a bike, sufficiently test, review, film, photograph, and disassemble a bike in that time frame, so they said, we're gonna go ahead and send us a kit anyway. So we got online to figure out which kit we needed. We answered a series of questions about my bike, including what size the wheel is, what size dropouts it has, whether it's a road bike, etc. We were converting my old Trek 100 road bike, by the way. We sent Switch the info and they boxed up a custom made wheel and all the parts and pieces we needed and shipped everything right to our door. There was one problem. The wheel didn't fit. Despite describing my bike and sending in photos of it, it wasn't gonna work. So I had to reach out and request a new wheel, which the brand sent, but it took a week or more for them to respond and another week or more for them to actually ship it. I started wondering if they only checked email on like Mondays. In addition to that, because there were zero instructions or parts lists included, I didn't realize until after the new wheel arrived that I was missing several other necessary components. Also, despite asking for them multiple times, I still had no instructions and the video that was online was absolutely useless. The brand has since printed a better instruction manual, but what the heck were they doing sending out media samples that were A, incomplete, and B, missing installation instructions? When I finally did get all the parts, pieces, and instructions about three to four shipments and weeks and weeks later, to the brand's credit, assembly was fairly straightforward and I assembled the kit in about an hour, no problem. But in the meantime, switch support regularly took days, if not weeks, to get back to me when I had questions, further prolonging the process every time I had a problem or a piece was missing. Long story short, I was just pretty frustrated with the kit from the beginning. But this was all pre-launch, so presumably they were still getting their crap together and maybe just got a little too excited and sent out test kits prematurely. But upon doing a deep dive on the interwebs, it seems like that's not the case. For starters, they're still in some sort of launch limbo, as in they only open up their website to pre-orders at the beginning of every month. Pre-orders. As in, once you hand over your credit card info, you still might not get your bike for months. There's even an option to pay less and wait longer, like 
six months longer. What? What? If you can't handle a manufacturing load, don't sell people bike conversion kits. That's just not good business. Also, their claim that the kit is universal. Any bike can be a switch bike. And we really mean any bike. Eh, not so much. The whole kit is definitely not compatible with every bike. Drop handlebars, for instance, can't accommodate the handlebar mounted accessories like the display and the throttle. You have to buy an extra adapter for it. And we saw some reviews that complained some parts didn't work on their bike at all, especially foldable bikes and other unique rides. And that customer service was just deplorable when they had order or warranty issues. So between the lack of communication, wrong and missing parts, which seems to happen way too often, and just general lack of business savvy, we were pretty unimpressed. In our research, we found a lot of reviews talking about how Switch had taken people's money and in some cases didn't deliver a product for over six months, sometimes up to a year. And even then, they were sending out incomplete kits and plenty of orders received no response from support. I really want to love this kit. The concept is great and it seems tolerably high quality, but that number of people experiencing that number of issues is a problem. So until they work out all of these issues, I can't in good conscience recommend this brand. Unfortunately, there aren't a ton of other kits like this out there, so you're back to either a full DIY kit or just buying an e-bike. That or rolling the dice and hoping for the best. Which is a bummer because the Switch itself, once you have all the parts and it's assembled, works really well. So it goes. If you liked this video, we definitely think you should check out some of our other ones. Maybe this review of the Santa Pi, a uh, Bluetooth enabled intercom for your helmet that will literally change the way you ride. Follow us on all the socials, we're at TerraDrift. And then if you feel like reading, check out TerraDrift.com for all kinds of reviews and how-tos. Then settle up, get out there, wander on.